Alright, so what we got here, we got the gray Air Force Ones. They call these drones the dust. I call them still. I call them fighter jets. That's what the fuck I call them. But yeah, you got your perforation holes, but they're not real holes. Like the water can't even see through these drones because these drones is waterproof. They made for you to go to war in, motherfucker. So when you on the block, right? You having to shoot out, and then you got run through the alleys and shit, or the driveways, or whatever the fuck your neighborhood look like. You got run through the mud and water and all that shit. Your feet will stay dry, and your cotton socks. You know what I mean? Got your your shoelaces. These drones are extra strong. They not like your regular shoelaces. You could use these to sneak up on somebody and choke them the fuck out. These is really made for combat, for real, for real. You see this right here? This shit like a utility belt. This shit got the utility belt on the back. You can put more things here. You can put your strap. You got your two places to put your strap. One strap right here, two strap right there. You put something else right here, put something right here. You mean you could tie a little boomerang to a string. Another Whatever utilities you like in your joint. You got a little bomb you want to take out, slide out when your James Bond shit like that. Throw it, blow up. And then these joints really made for combat. You got your secret hidden compartments in this bitch. You run out of bullets, you can keep a clip in this jaw. You can put your 22 in this jaw. I say this shit like six inches deep, five, six inches deep. About like four inches wide, no homo. Yeah, these are really military inspired and they really made for war and combat. You know what I mean? Maybe not the combat y'all used to. They go up extra high. And it's nice quality leather. Like, this ain't no cheap shit. And this shit is like crack leather, too. Like, the, the finish on it is like crack leather. So, it look like some dick that... Like, the paint look like your Air Force Ones if you had them for like two years. No, I ain't, I ain't even want to say two years. If you had them for like six months. And like, how them shits look cracked and all that. That's how I look on these up close. But it's not a bad finish. Like, they still look dope. And these drones will probably have less creasing because you see how this shit go down and up. This is like good leather. This or good fake leather, whatever the fuck this shit is, because I don't know. I just know this is premium. This is quick strike. And these motherfuckers wasn't giving out no military discounts at Foot Locker for these drones. These is full price. Let me see what that retail looking like. Mmm. Mmm. How much is these shits? 180 they ain't bad still cheaper than most Jordans and better than most Jordans for this limited edition Air Force One combat whatever the fuck you want to call it you know you got your uh, ballistic combat mesh shit that's on the back of your regular I know I named that shit wrong I don't know what the fuck that shit called but I had a pair of these on my army boots the tan drones cause you know I was in Iraq with that shit but yeah this shit is waterproof official you walking down the street, somebody want to slice your leg, they can't, can't get through that. It's, it's thick, it's thick. I think it would have been dope if the whole boot was made out of that. You know, like, or at least right here at the toe part, that would have been dope. But, hey, it's fucking dope, man. It's a dope concept. Salute to the troops. Salute to all the veterans. It's all love, man. Got full of cash.
good day, good day, good day. The day was a good day.